five, four individual problem, have one on one meeting. For multiple people, hold a team meeting. When you have an individual or two who are repeat offenders, you want to deal with them separately. Don't punish all for a few problem employees. However, when you are seeing a trend with multiple members of the team with attendance issues, you need to hold a team meeting and show the statistics. Stress how it can damage the achievement of goals. Reducing absenteeism might even turn into a goal in itself. This will show all that you are serious about attendance and how their attendance is important to the overall success of the team. Stress that you should not have to hire more people to achieve the goals due to poor attendance. This will put on certain peer pressure that can work to your benefit, especially if you offer a reward to the team if they achieve an attendance record you have set. 6. Allow for personal business. It is better for your employees to be up front and tell you the truth. There might be a few occasions when someone needs to take some time off in the day to handle something that can only be dealt with during business hours. Just make sure they do not take advantage of this gesture. 7. Create an award program for those who do not call out or are tardy for a certain period of time. It can be a paid day off or other ideas. It shows that even though you are a strict regarding attendance, you want to show your appreciation to those who make it a point to show up to work and being on time. 8. Have them make up time missed to make up for time lost. Depending on Employment Act and company policy, this may be an option. If not, can they use some of their vacation time, or get no time if they have already used up all of their sick time? No time means they would not get paid for the time missed. It would affect hourly or non-exempt employees much more. Next, what are the steps to take when dealing with attendance problems? Step 1, counsel and verbal warning. Remember to email or get their attention privately as to not embarrass the individual to meet in your office. Start off by stating you are concerned over the absences or tardiness. Establish the reasons and determine what needs to be done to improve the attendance issues.